Ultimate here, and today we're going to be talking about how you can integrate VC Face with your Twitch redeems, such as channel points, bits, and subscriptions. And basically what this means is that you can have something like this. Look inside my head. What's inside Fofa's head? What's inside Fofa's head? Hello. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so big. Let's get started on how to do this. First thing you're gonna need to do is make sure that you have VC face. If you don't know what VC face is, I do have a video on VC face up here that should be appearing in the corner. And then you're also gonna need something called Lioran board. Now, if you don't know what Lioran board is or you don't know how to set it up, I've already covered how to set up Lioran board in this video that's going to appear on the screen right there. So be sure to check those out if you want to learn how to set those up. So now that you have Lioran board and VC face both set up, this is what you need to do. Once you are in VC face, go to settings and expressions, and there you're going to see all of your different expressions that are there. And then you'll be able to assign a hotkey to them. What I recommend is just setting one of the hotkeys like what I have here, pumpkin, and I'm setting it to the F24 key. Now, if you don't have access to the F24 key, this is something that we can talk about later, but you can set it to any hotkey for now. Then you're gonna go into Lioran board, and then you're going to open and make a new deck. And you can just name this deck um, whatever you need to. So in this case, the new deck is gonna be called uh, VC Face Expressions. Then you are going to right click on the board and create a blank button. And then we're gonna be simulating a key press. In the simulated key press, you can either press the button that you want to be activated, or if you don't have a key that is activated, then you can go down and press the select key and you can select the keys there. For example, you can use this to press one of the F11 to 32 keys. And now you're gonna have a new button that is just for pressing F24. So, um, so you're gonna have a new button that's gonna be, should be the same hotkey that you have activated for VC face. So now that when you press that hotkey, you're gonna see your expression activate in VC face. If you want this to be activated by Twitch, we're gonna use uh, channel points as an example, but you can set this to bits. You can set this to subs, gifted subs, or even chat commands if you want to. For this example, we're gonna be using channel points. We're going to be making a new custom reward called pumpkin and you're just going to set it up and then copy paste the exact name of the reward. Now back in Lioran board, we're going to go down to and we're going to press the plus sign to add a new channel point redeem. And then we're just going to paste the exact same name of the channel point redemption. And then you're going to press done before you can test it out and make sure that it works. You need to make sure that when you're done with your Lioran board, you have to press done or else the changes won't apply. So as you can see here, the changes aren't applying. So you make sure that you press done in Lioran board. So now that you're back in the main screen of Lioran board, you can try your channel point redemption and then it should activate your VC face expression like you see right on the screen here. Now, the problem with this method is that it'll only press the hotkey and then it's not automated. So it's not going to activate the expression and then deactivate that. So this is what we want to do if you want to do that. So you're going to go back into Lioran board, into the board, and then get rid of the Twitch trigger. Now we're going to make a new button. And then we're just going to name this like um, pumpkin redeem. And then in this button redeem, we're going to add the Twitch trigger just like we did before. So we're going to be adding the, the point trigger as, and then make sure that you have the name exactly the same, just like before. You're going to right click and add a command. And we're going to be looking for button activation, as you're seeing on the screen right here. We're going to add trigger button and then we need the button ID. So if you right click on the pumpkin button that we made before that activated the hotkey, if you right click it, you can see the button ID. So in this case, our button ID is three. So now we're going to go back into the, the Twitch trigger button and then we're going to make sure that the button ID is the same number three. Now we're going to copy paste this. And now what we're going to do is we're going to make a second button that's identical and we're gonna add a delay. So in this case, we're gonna add a 10 second delay and that needs to be represented in milliseconds. What's gonna happen is that when someone redeems the pumpkin reward, then it's gonna activate the hotkey and then after 10 seconds, it's gonna press the hotkey again, meaning that it's gonna bring give you the pumpkin 
and then take away the pumpkin, as we see on the screen right now. And like I said before, you can actually change it so that you can have it activated by subscriptions, by specific bit amounts, by setting the range from like 101 bits to 101 bits. You can set it to have a chat command just by whenever that exact case sensitive thing is typed in chat, um, it'll activate those expressions as well. And you can also set that um, specific people like either a moderator or first subs or VIPs can only use that command and, or it'll only activate by those people. Now, if you want to make it so that let's say a moderator and a VIP can do it, you're going to have to make sure that you have two copies of the command with a moderator and VIP selected. And you can see it working just right here on the screen. All you need to do now is make sure that when you're using VC face and you're streaming, you just have to make sure that you launch Leoran board at the same time, have those um, automatic Twitch trigger expressions. If you want to be able to make it so that instead of having an expression activate, you can actually have these Twitch redeems activate an animation. Now there's already a great video out there that already covers how to activate animations through VC face. And you can see part of it on the screen right here. What I do recommend is check out that video by DEET. The link will be in the description down below or it should be popping up somewhere on the screen. And that's going to be using the VSF avatar format. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video informative. And if you have any questions, be, feel free to leave a comment down below and I'll try my best to answer it. Or I also stream on Twitch and you can just pop in on Twitch. Just come by and say hello. Thanks for watching. Bye.